You got your space cowboy ring. No. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. This is our new space cowboy rig. We're not talking Star Wars here, yeah. we're talking long range shooting. Open spaces, right? Yeah. Alright. Wow. Now this is... Scope friendly pistol holster. So you can wear this as a, on any of our gun belts or any belt as a strong side, high ride, uh, yeah. vertical holster. But we wanted to add some flair to it so you can add this to your drop rig. <laughs> and uh, again, you know, it keeps the gun at the ready position with such a long barrel. It keeps it, so we've, we've catered this really to the handgun hunting crowd. Yeah. Well, you know, for practical purposes, if I'm if I'm packing my big pistol, it's got a seven and a half inch barrel on it. Yep, that's a seven and a half inch red hawk. Yeah, right there. being able to get access to it, right. that's pretty valuable. Now, if a guy's on a horse and riding a quad, uh, we've also got Big Thunder. So Big Thunder, what we've done is we've distributed the weight. You know, the guns are getting so big, yep. you wear it on the side, yeah. uh, you're walking in a circle all day because right. the gun weighs so much. Right. So what Big Thunder does is that distributes the weight across the whole torso. So we're not calling this a shoulder rig, we're calling this a torso rig. Oh, that makes sense. So, I know several people that would love that. So this is going to keep, again, for hunters in mind, if you're on a quad, on a horse, it keeps the gun in the ready position. Think about when you're sitting in a tree stand, you've got that long barrel holster that's poking into the back of the tree, or your backpack gear. This keeps it, it's great in a tree stand. I mean, it well, keeps that gun right in the ready position. You know, and another aspect to this is, if I get off my horse and I jump in my truck, I'm not having to take my holster off. No, absolutely. With that seven and a half inch barrel, right. I could just, you know, right. wear it like that. And I mean, there's not a holster on the market that's going to fit. Uh, you know, this is a tiny torso on this mannequin. Yeah. And this will fit well over a 54 inch torso. It's, it's, uh, it's got and these Chicago screws, you can adjust this. It's going to have more adjustability than any holster on the market. Okay, how are we priced on these? This is going to retail the whole rig, $170. Okay. It's going to be half of what uh, a lot of our competitors are out there. So you can see the gauge of leather we've yeah. got yeah. on there. Everything that you see on a Triple K product is a solid brass. Made in the United States, made in Southern California. Mm -hmm. uh, no, I, I do leather work, so okay. you know that's the first thing I see when I see you know, when I come look at somebody's booth and they got leather products, the first thing I look at is the side of that leather and the quality of the leather. This is good stuff. So this is made in America quality. We're keeping 70 jobs here in oh, that's the awesome. United States. And uh, this is even domestic leather from the Midwest. So, awesome. you know, there's only two tanneries in the U.S., so yeah. this uh, comes out of the St. Louis tannery. That's awesome. You got anything else that's super cool? What, are, what do you got over here with these saddlebags? We got the... Oh, those are big. Big saddlebags here. At Triple K, we make a full line of saddlebags to cater to any style you want. We've got a... Oh, yeah. That's a more usable size for yeah. me. But... <laughs> hey, I like your stuff here. You got good quality leather, good product. Great. Right, those are 125 bag for... Oh yeah. You know, when the hunting season's over, guys yeah. can still go shoot traps. Yeah. Our European shooting bags over there. So. Well, you got you got some good stuff here. Triple K manufacturing, made years. in the USA for 69 years. That's that's good. Awesome. I really like this idea. That's a that's a slick concept. It is a lot of you know we get out in Montana. We know a lot of guys that run on horseback. Yeah. So then, I mean. You know, getting in, trying to get you know, your right. gun out of that. Right. I mean, having it right there, there's a bunch of steps. I mean, even without the mountain school, that's going to be a Well, I live in San Diego, but I'm an Arizona boy yeah. originally, so uh, I know the challenge of uh, getting it out of a vehicle. Yeah. With, oh, yeah. Yeah, that's big guns. That shelter rig. That's going to be fun.